Hey, it's Sydney, and this is my black and white staple series. If you're already part of my YouTube family, welcome back. If you're not, make sure to subscribe. I'm Sydney, this is Bunny, and in this series, I take a black or a white staple, so an item you probably already have in your closet, and I give you a week's worth of outfit ideas. Bunny's getting a little crazy, so let's get started with the white blazer. Oh my goodness, okay, let's do this, Bunny. A white blazer is just as versatile as a black blazer and it's a really great piece as we head into spring. So for the first few outfits, I wanna show how you can wear it when it's still cold out. One of my favorite ways is just with a sweater and jeans. So I'm just wearing a basic camel sweater, added in a camel scarf, some booties. So you could do this with black, you could do this with gray. It's a very classic look that you can wear over and over with different colors that you have in your wardrobe. Well, let's take the scarf off and now go for a different color sweater, blush. Blush is one of my favorites. It's become a neutral for me, so I wear it the same as I would with camel, white, or black. So here I'm wearing a blush sweater. If it's still cold, I might do an over-the-knee boot. And then when it warms up, I can swap my boots for pumps. I went matchy-matchy with a different pink, but you could do any shoe because as I said, blush is a neutral. And if you wanna dress it up a bit, you could always throw on some fun earrings. One of my favorite things about a white blazer is its ability to dress up anything, like literally anything. A basic t-shirt and sneakers, yep, already dressed up and a zillion times more chic thanks to the blazer. So I just did a graphic tee, some white sneakers, you could do any t-shirt you have in your closet and any color sneakers, because the great thing about white is it goes with everything. Now I wanna have some fun with belts. So I love belting blazers. It really shows off your waist, gives you that hourglass silhouette. So I'm gonna swap my t-shirt for a black tank. I did leather, but you could do any black you have in your closet. I just love the contrast of black and white. And then I swap my sneakers for some pumps and you just see that it creates that hourglass silhouette, really cinches you and creates a more feminine shape with the blazer. You can also do this for the office. So I'm gonna take off my jeans and switch it for the black pleated skirt. So you'll remember a couple weeks ago, I did how to wear a black pleated skirt for tons of different outfit ideas. Well, side note, I actually ripped my skirt during that episode. I know, embarrassing. So this is a new black pleated skirt that I picked up, but very similar vibe. If belting on top isn't your thing, you could belt inside. So the important thing is to show off your waist. So here I did a thinner belt and I wanted to add a little pop of color with pink. Now on to my favorite way to wear a white blazer. I actually wore this look to an event and I have never received so many compliments. It's called the white tuxedo. One way to make a tuxedo work is by layering a white camisole underneath, and maybe add a chain to add a little bit of gold to your look. If you're feeling more daring, you can belt the blazer and go without a camisole. Now, I don't really wanna take off my shirt in front of you guys, so I'm gonna still have my camisole underneath. Basically, you just wanna cinch your waist really tight and use a thinner belt so it stays put. You want the blazer to be a bit oversized because if it's a tighter blazer, it's not gonna work for this outfit. So I hope this gave you some ideas on how to rock the white blazer while it's still a little cold out. Like I said, the white blazer is something you can wear year round, so I'll be back in a couple of months showing some updated versions to wear it. And you can always head over to my blog, Sydney Style. I wear it all different ways over there, as well as a ton of outfit ideas. If you don't already, make sure to subscribe and make sure to tune in next week because I'm bringing back the trend guide for spring. So excited. I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Oh, I have earrings on.